This weekend, 2014, I battled Arsenal on Ether. You remember? Yes. Same weekend, 2016, battled Averb at the bunker. I've been the king at this forever. Next year, same weekend, Geechee Gotti. Do you see the theme it brings together? You're not even in the top three battlers I've battled on this weekend in December. <laughs> Because you are not the man you claim to be based on your more recent tournament features. Yet when he claims to have created this world, you put your views aside and just conform to believers. For me, it's not enough. I need to see some proof. Until then, you're nothing more than a preacher. How am I supposed to take it as gospel when it's only ever according to Peter? I mean, I asked... <laughs> Manchester for undisclosed seven. If you're with us, make some noise. Let's go. Yeah. We're about to get into the headline battle of the day. I'm absolutely buzzing. We managed to rearrange this to this card and finish off a great year for Premier Battles. I'm joined with my co host. Yo, it's Stro, Mr. I've seen more in the night than you've seen in your life. You already know it's cold, Jay, man. Make some noise. Yeah. Yo, so, and on the left hand side, making his debut uh -oh. in Premier Battles, Mr. Two Time Everything, a legend, Mount Rushmore, make some noise for me! On my right hand side, a worthy contender, the current UK champion, please make some goddamn noise! Subscribe and let us know in the comments who you think won. The coin was done. Up, uh, the coin toss was done off camera. The Saurus won. The champ starting round one. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. Let's go, bitch. What's good, Manchester? Yeah. I know he's from the states, and you're obliged to try and hype him up. But I'm ready to Shush. tip the scales. But I'm ready to tip the scales and have this all go my way with the slightest touch. Cause it's 2022. And I know we aren't really supposed to stereotype as much, but they say the British are polite, and they're right, cause I'm oh, nice as fuck. Oh. I need you all to look past the present day and how he's been more than uninspiring and ignore the fact he's struggled lately and most of his performances are tiring. This man is a living legend, and it's important you admire him. Help build each side to the ring we're standing in today. It's only right I let him choose which corner to retire in. You never, you never stood a chance the moment that you stepped into my second home. I'm hyper extending bones that'll bend thesaurus until his whole centre folds. This is for your health and safety. I'm warning you there's fire. So take a note of the exit shown. It's crazy how today is the end of his story. Yet I'm telling you all, this is how the legend goes. And it's a story. <laughs> Starring role for Peter. I've picked the perfect part for him to play. He didn't know this was a trap and that traveling to Manny, he'd be bartering with fate. Sort of like a saw film, it's going to be easier to die, much harder to escape. They asked who I want in battle rap. I said the jigsaw doll. Yeah, I'm targeting the face. So do you want to play a game? I'm teaching Thesaurus today, there's repercussions if the standards are low. You have two choices. Each represents a side of yours when it comes to the clashes you've had as a pro. You can either die by underperforming, like in all of the battles you treat as a laugh and a joke, or make it out alive by the skin of your teeth if we can actually see you start acting a goal. There's something different about this match for me. I suddenly feel a real anger within. You'd stand a better chance if you had in your plans extending your hand to tag your macula in. Cause I've... Cause I woke up on the wrong side of bed this morning. I almost felt like packing it in. Had to really drag myself to work and that is the reason I'm snapping at him. Cause Peter thinks he's beating me. He's absurd. 
you better give these fans the fight they prom you promised and make it one that we deserve or I'll quickly have thesaurus swallowing blood and really make him eat his words. These days, you look similar. You just like that same character, Pete. Feels like it's been years the real you hasn't been seen. Like Avril Lavigne, where are you, thesaurus? <laughs> Where are you, Thesaurus? Where's that raw passion, emotion, and all the love for this shit? The poker player's only interested in these cards when someone's calling and putting up chips. And when it comes to Peter, you're all being lied to. And we should be defunding it quick. Because we're wasting all this time protecting an animal that doesn't exist. We're built different here. We're built different here since you were last on road. So I hope it's a better drive that you've got inside you or I'll show how you're obsolete in this day and age and the entire threat of Morris Minor. You're gonna need so much more. You're gonna need so much more than James Bond bars to beat me. Believe me, it isn't gonna go well because I intend to leave a mess at his face by making sure every single blow felt, yeah. I'm leaving zero doubts in minds to whoever thought I wasn't beating him. I'm talking Mo saving Homer. You're gonna need a fan to help lift you up and leave the ring. Cause I can't. Cause I contain twice the amount of fire inside you seem to lack and need within. Thesaurus is a two-timer and his only alternative now is to cheat to win. You swam with some big fish back in the States, but over here is a type of fire that you won't have again. Yeah, you might have made it in the shark tank. Let's see if you can do it in the dragon's den. <laughs>out for this. Man, it's been years since I've seen some of y'all. Fucking Frankie, Bobby, how's the kids? <laughs> you know how it is. Found a crib, dropped a couple hundred thousand quid. I think that's about enough small talk for now. Let's get down to biz. <laughs> ain't nothing original about this bitch. You see how well the counterfeits? I ain't just blacking out on biz tonight. I'm wiping out the northern power grid. With metal, I'm an alchemist. Better with a bat than Alfred is. But I'm... <laughs> with metal, I'm the alchemist. Better with a bat than Alfred is, but I bet a bullet shut this building down before it even goes out of biz. I won't lie, dog. I wanted a battle soul, but I got you. This copy ain't click right, but you know how the icon do. I got a legacy that's lifelong, and my time's not through, so I brought new gadgets for Bond. Watch. Right on cue. <laughs> No American has had more of an impact on your scene. Before Adam had even battled, I first planted the seed. The only thing you have in common in this matchup with me, we both became the champ of a league unanimously. You're, You're here by accident, not exactly what the academy needs. To me, it's lunacy, but sometimes that's where matters can lead. You thought Shotty wanted to give it all to Bond and hand him the keys? Hell no. I said Autobahn, catch up to speed. You should fasten your seatbelt before you crash into me. This'll get bad as can be. Oh, fuck. This'll get... So I'm trying to sit with the very best in the world at this, but it's feeling like you sold me a dream. Because when I asked who the greatest really is, you all told me it's Pete, but after deeper research, I realize you're nothing more than me, immortal, mediocre, and weak. I mean, how is a supposed god of battle consistently so prone to defeat? So you aren't worthy of any worship or even any sort of chosen belief, and that's why it's so important for you all in this room to know that he's Greek, because I'm feeling like I've reached the summit of Mount Olympus where no one has been, and now the clouds have finally cleared, and yet there is not a single soul at the peak. I've been observing you, Pete. Trying to learn from your feet, but the stories are getting old and they need a new face now to transfer their belief. He might be a titan, Atlas travelled with the globe on his shoulders, unearthing the scene. But what's that compared to a man who has the whole world at his feet? Two time, two time everything. Yeah, slogan for two decades, he's bored us to death with. Hasn't won a thing in years and every time he battles the performance is desperate. Uh, but he's a founding father 
It's important we don't ignore or forget this. <laughs> he even wears clothing that says cookies because we're always forced to accept it. <laughs> Yo! Recently, your career has been a roller coaster, so up and down. Used to always promise us a show, but look around. These fans have gone from brimming with excitement, and now they're all just full of doubt because they've been watching your stock drop at a more alarming rate than foot and mouth. Bro, he's 20 years deep in this. And he's at a point his marketing has to excel because if he can't keep the consumer's attention, he already knows that it's back on the shelf. Thesaurus, Spider-Man. Yeah, I can see the comparisons well because the only good images of Peter are always the ones that he has of himself. I mean, losing... I mean, losing on these different... I mean, losing on these different leagues thinking you won't drop a tier, but you're already there. They ain't even hardcore matches yet, believe me, these falls count anywhere. Oh. I imagine this to go one or two ways today. Either make a classic and forever have a piece of history, or have them raving about this hand man and leave him flat out with a meaner victory. Notice how I said raving, some man, hardcore man. Yeah, well the reason is Pete. You all start again. <laughs> I imagine this to go one or two ways today, either make a classic and forever have a piece of history or have them raving about this hand man and leave him flat out with a meaner victory. Notice how I said raving, sand man, hardcore man. Yeah, well the reason is Pete, if I stop rapping and just stick it on you, I can't help it. It's just a dreamer in me. You've seen how I... You've seen how I've got these goals afraid. Bizzle's different, so insane. Bringing the sort of smoke that provokes a change on the global stage like the moment when the Pope is named. You see the effort you've lacked in recent years? It's my strongest and most focused trait. And while your name dwindles every closing day, mine continues to grow in frame. So it would be naive of you to fly to England thinking that our road's the same when the lane you coast in at your slowest pace is the one I use to overtake. You are no longer... <laughs> You are no longer top of the food chain and rather than evolve you've slowly demoted into lifeless prey. See the times when I couldn't match the higher pace inside the game, I'd find a way to reignite the flame. Whereas you, stick it out with the same style, don't even switch it in the slightest and decline away until every last ounce of your hype is drained. You'd have thought boarding a flight that travels forward in time would help you realise now that times have changed. Oh, wow. <laughs> Knocked out with a Grand Prix, missed the playoffs in S1. Can you see why my faith decreases? But then again, I guess he wouldn't be Greek if he didn't leave so many plates in pieces. <laughs> <laughs> These fans could be paleontologists and would struggle to find a time you last struck fear in matches because the footprint Saurus left behind is fading with every single year that passes. Time. Let's go, man. <laughs>
<laughs> now watch Bizzo Bond get stole on and choke slammed by Big Show's palm because I'm still pissed how Bobby Rex got did so wrong. Where the fuck are all the big fish in this old pond? Another white dude with long-winded bolties. The list goes on. <laughs> and today you'll find out whether or not your champ is even a contender. We'll see what Rady is in this circle once I see him at the center. Get beat till you surrender and I ain't even being the aggressor. But let me leave you some perspective on why I'm not feeling any pressure. This weekend, 2014, I battled Arsenal on Ether. You remember? Yes. Same weekend, 2016, battled Averb at the bunker. I've been the king at this forever. Next year, same weekend, Geechee Gotti. Do you see the theme it brings together? You're not even in the top three battlers I've battled on this weekend in December. <laughs> never be the goat with long-winded lines like his, but you can find my highlight vids no matter what the timeline is. Mind my biz, you won't beat me in this lifetime biz, and I'm gonna paint the picture clearer for you than hindsight is. I'm from that OG legend crop, transcended every era crop, the real face of where it all started if you connect the dots. Free or written, check in every box where the best had to protect their spots, and winner take all determined whether you got a check or not. You you from that 2013 pathetic crop. He's, ha <laughs> he's having second thoughts. Disappeared for five years because he couldn't make the pressure stop. Then comes crawling back, hoping that everybody had just forgot when in reality there was no difference between you and an empty slot. Time. <laughs>
glory days are behind you, they're long gone and now Biz is the top don. What's Mr. Two Time to a guy that can drop a single line and the fans say we got one? But I still see so many people in this game throwing shade with zero reason into hate. But I'm just like you, choosing to move from your roots. There is simply no keeping me at bay. I mean, they've seen the murders for themselves, but still don't know whether to believe it's really me and it is strange. I mean, I knew what I was capable of from day one and they still expect me to plead that I'm insane. I mean, remember when they said, remember when they said I was boring, nothing special, only ever average on this stage, so I went and won the Anarchy Tony, and they said, okay, but surely it won't last, it's just a phase. Then it was I didn't earn the title, you now backed out and it was handed on the plate. And then it was, yeah, okay, he's beat Koji, but it wasn't like he was battling the great. <laughs> So then I faced Tony D, who arrived in his prime, and it was clear our levels were matching up the same. I thought I'd finally made it to the promised land, and now I've got Peter standing at the gate! Oh! 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 I've, well, I've been humble long enough. This is what I love and I've grown fatigued of keeping silent. Too many people bleed it dry yet try and criticise me rather than be pleased to see me shining. They forget that all the giants stayed inside their caves as this scene slowly weakened from the virus and I'm the one who made his way outside, became the North Face, an outfit that was needed for this climate. While there was disagreements in the forums and self-entitlement was keeping us divided, I just entertained the fans on Twitch with each performance more intriguing and exciting. So for those who think Thesaurus doesn't make much sense, there's a deeper reason that's been hiding a thesaurus is the closest book to explain how I took the meaning of this scene and redefined it. So I don't care if Biz or Bond is not the one and someone you still don't see the hype with. I'm the saviour whether you choose to believe and not even Peter can deny it. He thought he was standing at Peter's gate. We watched this clown drop fast. Cause it was really Gandalf the Grey and bitch, you shall not pass! <laughs> become exhausting. To get my mind back into battle mode, I had to turn to other options, because y'all's battles always inspired me the most, but it still hurts too much to watch them. But making y'all proud's what I want, because I know my bros are watching, so I won't let the emotion of both their losses hold me hostage. And my growth is largely the result of what they both accomplished, so I know putting my best foot forward's the only option. built a brand in battle rap before battlers were considered brands. And maybe one day I'll have the distant chance of impacting the world like Bizzo can. <laughs> it seemed like every day last month, Kanye was on a crazy Hitler rant. <laughs> Until Bizzo Bond put out a hot 16. <laughs> Until Bizzo Bound put out a hot 16 denouncing it on Instagram. <laughs> now, my first reaction was like, really? I, I don't know if Kanye will even give a damn. <laughs> but y'all, he's got 1,500 followers. <laughs> Clearly there's a bigger plan. <laughs> I'm just saying, once this verse goes viral, shit's really gonna hit the fan. 2,000 views later, you really made a difference. <laughs> it, in it, fam. <laughs> I mean, I don't know about y'all, but I have to give credit. How many of you scumbags can say you singly handed you single-handedly ended anything anti-Semitic? <laughs> I mean, I don't know if people could even dream this. The only ones I could think of, like off the top of my head, would be Floyd Mayweather, Eminem, and Jesus. <laughs> Bond. There isn't any stopping you. 
<laughs> and Instagram's monetizing now, so you probably made a pretty penny off it too. <laughs> I'm already waiting for when that next big drop is drew due. Oh shit, it just came out. You dissed Balenciaga too? <laughs> you, you little trending topic, you. <laughs> Now let me talk the truth and give it real meaning. Ah, fuck it. Either that or I'll just give you a real beating. I'll leave you knocked unconscious, rob your pockets while you're still breathing, then split biz into pieces like a will reading. Time. Let's go, let's go. I'm sorry, bro.